Vlogmas? Yeah. What? That's the coolest. <laughs> well, I hope Dude. you're happy Vlogmas then, you know? Welcome to Vlogmas Day 8. We're trying something new today. My vlog camera came with these little sticky pads to put on things. So I put one in my car. We're going to see how this works, how this looks. I'm really hoping this works out. It came with two of them. So we're going to put one, I put the one in my car, and then we're going to put one in my partner's car. That way when we're traveling, when we're driving around, hands-free, uh, you know, camera experience. So this should be fun. This should be good. I feel like the camera's like way over here, so I have to lean over, but I know it's like a wide shot. So it's Monday, which means it's grocery day. I'm on my way to the grocery store right now. When we get home, we'll do a little grocery haul. And then I also have to meal prep today. I have to clean the kitchen first because it's a disaster from this weekend making all the ornaments. There's bird seed everywhere. And then fold the laundry so it's gonna be a chill day at home little gisting day getting stuff done as soon as I am done at the grocery store we wish you a Merry Christmas we wish you a Merry Christmas we wish you a Merry Christmas and a happy store I'm gonna do a little grocery haul we're gonna ignore the mess behind me I'm gonna clean it up after we do this grocery haul that way I can get the groceries in the fridge okay ooh, ooh, ooh. Uh, first of all I grabbed this juice that I already started drinking tropical greens coconut water pineapple apples mango and kale it's the only way I can get myself to drink coconut water so this Whole Foods was out of regular little packs of tofu, so we got a big ass thing of tofu, which is fine. I'm going to use probably at least half of it this week, and I might use the rest of it by the end of the week or into next week. I like having tofu on hand just to do like stir fries and quick easy meals, so I'm okay with having extra. I usually always have extra on hand. We got flaxseed because I'm out, almost out of flax meal, avocados. There are apples in here. I'm making a recipe this week that calls for peanut oil, so I grabbed some of that. And then I'm almost out of non-stick spray, so I need some more of that. And I'm almost out of night face cream, so I got some of this. It's the Pacifica Dreamy Youth Day and Night Cream. So when I run out of day cream, I'm gonna switch to just using this because you can use it day and night, and I only need to buy one thing. And what flavor is this? Island Mimosa flavor coconut and mango leaf body soap. I got a pound of portobello's. That's going to go in this mushroom gumbo that I'm making. A thing of celery. Oh, I grabbed another juice for tomorrow or for some later time this week whenever I want to have it. It's Autumn Harvest Apples, Cranberry, and Beets. It actually sounds really good. I like cranberry juice, but it's too tart. So I feel like the apple juice probably makes it like a lot sweeter. And then I like bee juice because it's also sweet. So I feel like this would be really good. And I've never seen it before. I think it's like a special run because like, because it's cranberry season. Um, yes, I did buy broccoli already cut up in a bag. Look, sometimes I need to be lazy. Most of my vegetables I got in my reusable produce bags. But I bought some broccoli at the farmer's market. I just didn't think it would be enough. So I also got some at the store because being able to just throw some steamed broccoli for a snack or to have with lunch or dinner helps me stay healthy and makes things really easy. I got some kimchi because we ran out of kimchi last week and some cashew butter because we ran out of cashew butter last week. I 
put this in the cookie dough. I grabbed some allspice. I needed it for a specific recipe and I don't remember which recipe that is right now, but I needed some. I grabbed some yogurt. Sometimes I like having yogurt as like an easy breakfast. So I don't have to make a smoothie or anything. I can just like have some frozen berries and some yogurt or putting it on top of like curries and stuff. I just really like to have yogurt around. I was out of vanilla extract, so we got some more of that. And then look at this. Pecan Milk Nog, holiday edition. Non-dairy, gum free. I got this, I wanted to get an eggnog while I was at the store since it's that season. And I got this specific one because it had the least amount of ingredients. All it is is filtered water, organic sprouted pecans, organic maple syrup, natural vanilla flavors derived from vanilla beans, organic cinnamon, nutmeg, organic nutmeg, and salt. And that's it. That's the only things that are in here. So I really wanted to try this eggnog. I feel like it'll be really good because it's made from pecan milk. So I feel like that's going to give it a really nice flavor. Cilantro. I picked up some more of our favorite dressing. It's the sesame ginger oil-free dressing. It is so good. Um, I use this for like stir fries or to dip spring rolls in. It's just really nice to have around to throw on salads or broccoli or anything. It's so good. Some arrowroot powder. I needed this for some breaded tofu that I'm making this week. And surprisingly on my whole wall of starches and flours, I didn't have arrowroot powder, so. And some orange juice. I usually buy orange juice every week because so we put it in our smoothies and my partner likes to just have a glass of orange juice. And lastly, some oat milk. I actually probably should have bought two because we've been going through oat milk like pretty quickly. Like we'll get through this by like Friday or by like Thursday or Friday because we've been having hot chocolate. So I'll put a cup in our smoothies in the morning, but then we'll end up having like two more cups later in the day when we make hot chocolate. So hopefully I don't run out. And that's it. That is everything I bought at Whole Foods except for the sandwiches that we already ate because we had lunch before I started putting everything away which was just they in their like grab and go section where they have like stuff that they prepared at Whole Foods they had um TLTs which was tempeh bacon lettuce tomato sandwiches and they were so good on some ciabatta bread now I need to get all of this in the fridge I showed my partner this and he wants to try it right now so we're gonna pour some in his Avengers cup and we're gonna try it right now just to shake it really well oh, it smells really good you can smell the nutmeg and cinnamon it doesn't need that much right yeah that's probably plenty I'm disappointed it tastes really good, but it's not creamy enough. It's like not creamy enough and it doesn't quite have enough flavor. Like it's really watery tasting. Man, I'm really disappointed now. What if I mixed like some oat milk in it? I bought full fat oat milk this week, so maybe if I mix some oat milk in it, it'll be better. Let's go bring it to him and let him try it. Taste test the pecan nog. Smell yummy. It's not bad. It tastes very watery. I feel like I wish it was a little creamier. That's what I thought. Yeah. yeah. Do you want me to add some oat milk to it? That's what I was thinking about doing. Could. Yeah. Yeah. Shake, shake, shake. I shake it up really well, so I don't know why it was like that. Did you put my work knife up on the knife bar? Yeah, I did that yesterday. I don't yeah. want that. Oh. Takes up too much room on the knife bar. Mm. And that's my travel knife. Okay, then. I'm gonna put it in your travel kit. That's a little better. Yeah? Try it. It might need like a little agave, maybe be a little bit sweeter or something. I will. I'm confused by this. <laughs> That's better. Um, I was gonna say cinnamon, but more cinnamon. Put some cinnamon in. It. 
feel like it's already pretty cinnamony though. I just, I don't know what it's missing. It's like not, it's, it's not like rich water enough. nog instead of like actually pecan milk. Yeah. Like, I don't know. Don't give it back to me. I don't want right, it. Okay, well, I'm gonna have it. I'm gonna drink it. Okay. What if we put chocolate milk? That would probably be interesting. Uh, hang on. I daily reminded that you were the baddest bitch on the block. Not on my block, though, but on your block for sure. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Okay, we're off to go pick someone up get hot chocolate, and then see the lights, and then I think we're actually gonna end up going out to dinner because my yeah, friends are in town. <gasps> my watch! I went to check the time and my watch wasn't on my hand. Doop, 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 doop. Oh! Oh! Please, God, I just want a black coffee! Black coffee, I'm your coffee guest. No! Whoosh, excuse me. <laughs> Alexa, living room lights, off. Okay. Do you have your water? I have my water. Good job. Let's go. Here we go. These are already untied? Demons. I feel like I literally say I'm running behind every day on here, but you know what? My I'm grandma lives her life running behind and she's a success, so it's fine. How are you? Good. Thank you so much for asking. What can we get for you? Four hot chocolates with almond milk, yeah. Um, part of me wants to get a peppermint hot chocolate, but I don't know. Can I do a peppermint hot chocolate with soy milk? I'll just do the regular one that you're going to get. The almond milk? Yeah. Okay, cocoa and almond, soy, two peppermint, so one peppermint soy, one peppermint yeah, almond. Yeah, I can't do soy milk. Okay. Okay, we would like two hot chocolates with almond milk. Okay, what size are those gonna be? Grande. Grande. Okay, and do you want the whipped cream? No. No. <laughs> okay, perfect, I've got that. What else for you guys? Wait, did you tell the milk substitute? Okay, yeah, said the, I said almond milk. Um, one peppermint hot chocolate. hot chocolate with almond milk. Okay, peppermint hot chocolate with almond milk. Is that one also going to be a grande with that whipped cream? Yes. Perfect, okay. And then a peppermint hot chocolate with soy milk, also grande with no whipped cream. Okay, sounds great. I've got all four of those done. What else for you? I believe that will be all for us. Wonderful, it's gonna be 1905. Come on up, thank you. Thank you. So excited, so happy, I love this. You're one of your best friends. <laughs> Four hot chocolates, right? Huzzah! Hey, 1905. Huzzah. Did you say huzzah? I said so huzzah. happy. That made me, I was really <laughs> hoping that that's what you said. <laughs> and then you did say it, so. It's an appropriate response. I got all, do you want any drink stoppers, by the way? Mm, I don't think so. I think okay, these are. A couple of says, I realize they're sort of overflowing with joy. But it's all right. That's why okay, we wait, like wait. them. Okay. okay, and each of them are labeled, by the way, on the stickers. I apologize. Okay. So, yeah, just right behind the sleeves. Might be a little bit of here's the one actually. Thank you so much. Uh, uh classic. Are you filming right now? Yep. Vlogmas. Vlogmas? Yeah. What? That's the coolest. <laughs> well, I hope Dude. you're happy Vlogmas then, you know? What this is, is a regular? Name? I'm Tim. Tim. Regular. And who was the girl on the thing? Christy. Perfect. That's our manager. She's freaking amazing. I need to send the text and yeah, say that y'all were awesome. What? <laughs> thing that needs to happen. Hey man, uh, Wait, what's your name? What do y'all say? Matt. Matt? Hi. Lilith. Nice to meet you guys. I like your uh, ears. Very cool. Thank you. All right. We'll see y'all later, okay? Thank you. Thank you much. You have a great one. <laughs> okay. Uh, Two. Chocolate. Classic. This one's yours. So I'll grab that one for Mackenzie. Urchins. Jesus. Oh. That was awesome. They were so nice. We're going in! It's time! We're here! Dashing through the snow In a one horse open sleigh O'er the fields we go Laughing all the way Bells on bobtail ring Making spirits bright What fun it is to ride And sing a sleigh song tonight Oh, jingle bells, jingle bells Jingle all the way Oh, what fun to ride in a one horse open sleigh 
Food time! Food time! Come on, grab your friends. We're going to the dairy. Breakfast land. <laughs> We just got home from the Trail of Lights and having dinner. It's about 10 o'clock, so it is time for bed. We are both so tired. Thank you guys so much for watching Vlogmas Day 8. I hope you enjoyed today's video. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram, Twitter, and TikTok. Hit that subscribe button and ring that bell so you never miss a Vlogmas Day. And like this video if you liked all of the light displays that people worked so hard to put up so that we could still see them this year. For context, Trail of Lights is usually a walkthrough thing, but they converted it to a drive-through this year. That way we could still enjoy it. And I'll see you guys tomorrow.